To change PowerShell's script execution policy, run PowerShell as an administrator and type set execution policy and choose from one of the available policies. I'll choose unrestricted and then type Y to confirm the change. I use get, get execution policy to verify that the current policy matches what I requested via set execution policy. It's also possible to skip the confirmation step by running get execution policy and specifying the force parameter. Notice that the policy has been updated, but I didn't need to confirm this change. It is a system-wide change, so any new sessions of PowerShell will use the execution policy you've specified here. However, it's important to note that if you use PowerShell Core, it won't use the same policy. If I go ahead and run PowerShell Core as an administrator, you can see that the execution policies don't match. The method for updating them is exactly the same. I'll choose Restricted, but notice in PowerShell Core, I don't get asked to confirm the change. Again, with PowerShell Core, this is a system-wide change, so any new sessions for PowerShell Core will honour what you've specified here. If you just want to update the execution policy for one session, rather than all future sessions, you can run PowerShell.exe and specify an 